Betelgeuse remains one of the most captivating astronomical objects in the night sky, not only for its staggering size and brilliant luminosity, but also for the profound questions it raises about the life and death of stars. Located roughly 650 light-years away in the constellation Orion, Betelgeuse is a red supergiant, a stellar class that represents one of the final stages in the evolution of massive stars. With a radius hundreds of times that of the Sun, if Betelgeuse were placed at the center of our solar system, its outer layers would extend beyond the orbit of Jupiter. Its immense scale is difficult for the human mind to fully comprehend, Yet it is precisely this vastness that makes Betelgeuse such a critical target for astronomers seeking to understand how the universe recycles matter and energy. The peculiarities of Betelgeuse behavior have made it a subject of intense scrutiny, especially in recent years. In late 2019, Betelgeuse underwent a historic dimming event, dropping in brightness by nearly 40%, sparking speculation that it might soon explode as a supernova. While such an explosion would not threaten Earth due to its distance, it would be an unprecedented spectacle, potentially visible even during the daytime. Later studies revealed that the dimming was caused by massive dust clouds expelled from the star's surface, obscuring its light from our view. This episode underscored the dynamic and turbulent nature of a red supergiant's late life. Betelgeuse is constantly shedding mass through powerful stellar winds and violent surface convection producing enormous plumes of gas and dust. These processes are essential for seeding the interstellar medium with heavy elements, the raw ingredients for future generations of stars and planets. The calcium in our bones, the oxygen we breathe, and the iron in our blood were all forged in the cores of massive stars like Betelgeuse and spread across the galaxy through supernova explosions. Despite everything we've learned, Betelgeuse still holds countless secrets. Astronomers are using every tool available to probe its internal structure, hoping to unlock the mysteries of its fate. Advanced Asteroseismology, the study of stellar oscillations, lets scientists listen to the star's internal rumblings, offering clues about the processes occurring deep beneath its visible surface. High-resolution imaging from instruments like the Very Large Telescope Interferometer has revealed Betelgeuse turbulent surface, complete with bright hot spots and massive outflows of material. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has opened a new chapter in the study of Betelgeuse. With its powerful infrared capabilities, JWST can peer through dust clouds and offer astonishing clarity of the star's inner workings. Already, it has provided insights into temperature variations across Betelgeuse's surface and the composition of its ejected material. Studying this surrounding dust and gas helps astronomers understand how red supergiants lose mass and how their expelled matter interacts with the interstellar environment. The importance of Betelgeuse's eventual explosion cannot be overstated. It offers a rare opportunity to study a nearby core collapse supernova up close. Supernovae are among the most energetic events in the universe, releasing more energy in days than our sun will in its entire lifetime. They play a critical role in galactic evolution, dispersing heavy elements and triggering the birth of new stars. However, many aspects of the supernova process are still not well understood. Models struggle to fully explain how the core collapse triggers an outward shock, how neutrinos drive the explosion, and how asymmetries in the blast influence the resulting neutron star or black hole. When Betelgeuse eventually explodes, it will serve as an unparalleled laboratory for testing these models. Scientists across the globe are preparing telescope networks, neutrino detectors, and gravitational wave observatories to capture every aspect of the event. Early warning systems like the Supernova Early Warning System, SNUs, designed to detect the burst of neutrinos that will precede the explosion's visible light by several hours, allowing telescopes to catch the very first moments of the event. But the supernova itself is only part of the story. The aftermath, an expanding nebula and possibly a compact remnant, will offer decades or even centuries of scientific discovery. If the core collapse leaves a neutron star, astronomers can study its pulsar emissions and magnetic field. If it forms a black hole, we'll gain rare observational evidence of stellar mass black hole formation. In either case, the chemical fingerprints in the ejected material will tell us about the nuclear processes that occurred in the star's final moments. Yet beyond the science, Betelgeuse's story resonates deeply with our shared human experience. For millennia, people have gazed up at Orion and marveled at its bright shoulder. 
The idea that this familiar star is nearing the end of its life reminds us that nothing in the universe is static. Even the most brilliant and enduring stars must eventually fade or explode. This cosmic drama connects us to the larger universe, reminding us of our place in it. Just a few centuries ago, a bright new star in the sky would have been interpreted as an omen. Today, we understand it as the death cry of a massive star, part of the ongoing cycle of creation and destruction that defines the cosmos. Studying Betelgeuse speaks to the incredible ingenuity of humanity. From ancient sky watchers to modern scientists building multi-billion dollar space observatories, we've always been driven by a desire to know more. Observing Betelgeuse combines rigorous science with a timeless wonder, rooted in our innate urge to look up and ask, what is out there? As we await its final act, we are reminded of the delicate balance that governs the cosmos. Massive stars live short, violent lives, but in their deaths they give rise to new stars, planets, and the very conditions needed for life. The atoms in our bodies, carbon, nitrogen, oxygen, were forged in ancient stellar furnaces and spread through supernovae. When Betelgeuse explodes, it will add its own unique chemical signature to the galaxy, contributing to a cycle that may one day lead to new life. The global anticipation surrounding Betelgeuse fate is a testament to human curiosity and our enduring connection to the stars. Whether the explosion occurs tomorrow, a thousand years from now, or has already happened and its light is still on its way to us, the story of Betelgeuse captures something essential about our relationship with the cosmos. We are small, fragile beings on a tiny planet orbiting a modest star, yet we have developed the tools and insight to understand the most colossal events in the universe. In many ways, we are the universe becoming aware of itself. So we continue to watch Betelgeuse, night after night, knowing the sky will one day change. When that moment comes, we won't just witness the death of a star, we will witness the continuation of a cosmic legacy billions of years in the making. In that moment, we will remember that we, too, are made of stars, woven from their remnants and destined to share in their eternal cycle of birth, death, and rebirth. As preparations continue worldwide for this monumental event, coordinated networks of ground-based telescopes, space observatories, neutrino detectors, and gravitational wave instruments stand ready to capture every moment. The James Webb Space Telescope, Hubble, the European Extremely Large Telescope, and others will provide complementary data, creating the most detailed supernova record in history. This is not merely academic, it's a once-in-a-human history event with potential to revolutionize astrophysics. The story of Betelgeuse has even captured the public's imagination. When the star dramatically dimmed in 2019, speculation and excitement spread across social media and science centers alike. The idea that a naked eye star might explode soon fascinated millions, revealing a deep, instinctive connection people feel to the night sky. Betelgeuse has become a cosmic celebrity, admired not only by scientists but by stargazers and dreamers around the world. Based on models, its explosion could outshine the full moon for weeks, even visible in daylight. At night, Orion's familiar shape will be transformed by a blazing beacon on its shoulder. This brilliant supernova, likely the brightest since Kepler's in 1604, will be an unforgettable sight. But after the fireworks, the real scientific work will begin tracking the expanding remnant, mapping the interstellar medium, and studying the long-term effects of the blast. Over decades, the nebula will evolve into a complex web of glowing filaments rich in heavy elements, possibly giving birth to new stars and planets. Interestingly, Betelgeuse's story has sparked new questions about how massive stars die. Not all red supergiants end the same way. Some may collapse into black holes quietly in what's called a failed supernova. Others may undergo dramatic eruptions before collapsing. By studying Betelgeuse and comparing it to similar stars, scientists hope to understand what determines whether a star dies with a bang or a whisper. If a neutron star emerges, it will offer insights into some of the densest, most extreme objects in the universe. If it forms a black hole, we'll observe stellar mass black hole formation as never before. And even now, we look into the past when we observe Betelgeuse, the light we see began its journey 650 years ago. If it has already exploded, we're simply waiting for its light to reach us. In this sense, Betelgeuse is a cosmic time capsule, a glowing reminder of the universe's deep history. Looking ahead, the study of Betelgeuse is helping shape the future of time domain astronomy, 
a field dedicated to tracking transient cosmic phenomena. From supernovae and gamma ray bursts to fast radio bursts and gravitational mergers, the universe is full of fleeting, dramatic events. Betelgeuse is helping us prepare for this dynamic cosmic landscape, training us to respond quickly, coordinate globally, and extract the richest possible data. Ultimately, Betelgeuse reminds us of the universe's beauty, complexity, and impermanence. Even the most massive, seemingly eternal objects are subject to change. Yet from this transformation comes renewal, new stars, planets, and life. For us on Earth, the death of Betelgeuse will mark a moment of cosmic significance, tying together science, wonder, and humanity's eternal curiosity. When that day arrives, we will not just watch, we will understand. We will be children of the stars, bearing witness to the death of one of our cosmic ancestors, and to the rebirth that follows.